Hello, everybody. Welcome to C programming course. So, in this course, this is the first lecture today. So, we're going to learn about how to set up C programming environment. So, in C programming, we will learn uh, language, C language, using code blocks IDE. So, let's first download the code blocks type code blocks on any browser then we go to the downloads this is a code blocks main website so we click downloads okay here you can see few types different types of installing version so we need the binary release click on binary release okay if you are using Windows, this is for Windows installation. If you are using Linux, these are for Linux installation. So first, I'm using now Windows 7. So we download this version of code blocks. Uh, this one, this version has a compiler, including compiler. So let's click on. Uh, SourceForge using SourceForge download. Okay, in a few seconds it will start download. Mm -hmm. Let's wait. Mm -hmm. Let's wait. It's depending on our uh, internet. I have already downloaded the code blocks uh, installation file. So let's run it. Alright. So this is a code blocks installation file. Click on the uh, right click of your mouse. Run as administrator. You want to install it? Yes. Okay. Okay. Click next. Agree. Okay. You see, this all the <coughs> this one is a compiler, so it should be all clicked. Okay. Then next. So where do you want to install it? Just browse and choose the file path. I want to install on T disk. Okay, then install. Now installation started. Let's wait. You can create C or C++ uh, projects using code blocks program software okay it's taking time once it's installed uh, we will see the first program we're going to test our first program Let's wait now. Okay, do you want to run code blocks now? We say yes. Okay, now it's running. Okay, this is our code blocks environment. Okay, so first we need to do is set the compiler. So go to the settings, click compiler, and click reset defaults. Okay, yes. Are you really sure? Yes, sure. Okay, now it's detected the compiler, which is min GW. Okay, click OK. So let's create our first program. 
click file and new click on file again okay now you can see the types of file you can choose now we want to create a C file C program so we choose a C uh, slash C++ source go next C next and now we have to choose a file pass so you have to choose here let's first program this is a program file name which is your first program click and say finish okay so now we are ready to write our first program first we write hash include which means we calling the uh, library studio library we'll go in details in later uh, classes so this is our main let's write print we want to print uh, this is my first program okay this is my first program okay now what you have to do is debug it what is debug is uh, which means it will uh, check your code if there is any error during the debug it will tell you for example, if we delete this semicolon, which means line 5 has an error, so let's debug it. Okay, you see this red square in front of line 5. These numbers are line. It's the first line, second line, third line, all the way to seventh line. So in the fifth line, we have an error. Here you can see error expected semicolon before is closing curly bracket so which means we have to put semicolon here now our, our program should be fine let's debug it so there's no error now you can which, uh, by the way this is a debugging button which means it says build and this is a we can run our program so we already debug it there's no error so we can run and test our problem okay you see now this first line is our program's output this is my first program so our program is working or you can change uh, this sentence uh, this is C programming programming course then let's run it. You see now, no, we have to first debug and run. You see now it's saying the updated version. This is C programming course, this is output, this is C programming course, which means our program is working fine. Okay, everybody, this was the first uh, class. Uh, next classes will learn more in details so you try by yourself test it learn get you know make it more practice